Hello my dear family members, I hope all of you are preparing well for your upcoming campus drive. I know actually you are hard working and no one can negatively remark your struggle. As you know from December to February many companies were visiting campuses and announcing new hiring. But suddenly they stopped. This is all because of new financial year is coming and general election is going to be conducted soon. So after a few days the situation will be taken place. By the way within very few days Cognizant and Capgemini going to take their assessment. So I will now discuss a coding question which is very important for any company. So let's see. So the question is. Uh, actually, this question was really asked in Capgemini last drive, I mean on uh, February. So, I didn't get the actual questions uh, from the screenshot, but I get this from a student. So, the question is, take array as an input of size n, need to print the element of an array in alternating manner such that first element should be the max element and second element should be the minimum element and third element will be the second largest and fourth element will be the second smallest element and so on so let's make it more clear so at first let's say uh, you have been given an array like this okay so at first you have to print the largest element from this array like 7 is the largest element then you have to print the smallest element so among these array elements one is the smallest element then the third element should be second largest element so sorry actually this should be 8 right 8 is the largest element and the smallest element is 1 and at the third position the second largest element should be there and at the fourth position the second smallest element should be taken place and at the fifth position the third largest element should be there and then the third smallest element should be there at the last okay so this is the uh, this is this is what you have to do right so i hope you understood what you have to do right and if you are given more number of elements then keep doing thus uh, keep following the same pattern and arranging in the same manner right so let's see another example and i hope this will be more clear let's say the array elements are 5 3 7 2 8 okay so what should be your output that is at first the largest element then the smallest element then the second largest element that is 7 in this case and then second smallest element that is 3 and then uh, the and then the third largest element right so that is 5 so this way you have to arrange the output uh, array right and you have to return it okay so i hope you understood what your task is right so if you understood then please start solving and give the answer in the comment section right okay so let's solve the problem actually uh, as i am solving this problem for capgemini and cognizant and in the recent time cognizant is asking and specif specifying that you have to solve this problem using python so i will choose python to solve this problem for today okay if you are uh, willing to get the solution in java then let me know in the comment section i'll try to assist you okay and uh, what should be the approach to solve the problem now let me clear it so let's say you are given this array to solve okay so what i would do at first i will make it sorted right let's say what should be the sorted form of this array so one two then three then 5 then 7 then 8 okay so this is the sorted form in the ascending order of this array right so what is our task that is at first i have to assign i have to initialize a variable with uh, let's say left uh, and i have to locate i mean i have to point this uh, array zero element and with the right variable i have to assign or i have to locate at the last element of this array right so at first my left variable will be pointing to this first element and my right uh, variable will point at the last uh, element of the array right and i will keep increasing the left variable and i will keep decreasing the right variable by one at each time in in a loop 
and I will uh, comparing them if they are not equal I mean if the left is not equal to the right then uh, append uh, at append the right value at first inside uh, a, an empty list and then append the left value in the same empty list right so uh, in this way uh, we will get the desired output okay so if you uh, didn't understand yet then uh, after seeing the solution you will uh, you will understand what i am trying to un make you understand okay so let's uh, start solving the problem okay so let me define the function let's say arrange and an array as an argument uh, which will be arranged in the said format right so at first what we would do at first uh, we'll sort the array right so array dot sort by using this inbuilt function we can make the array sorted right so nowadays actually the inbuilt function are allowed to do allowed to write right and let's say you are asked to sort an array as the main task then you can't use inbuilt function right so just um, be mindful about that okay so now our task is to assign let's say my array elements are this okay so at first when we are sorting then array elements will be like uh, this right so let me copy it and let me paste it here so at first my array elements are sorted like this right so what is my task right now it is i have to make a pointer left and i will make a pointer right okay so why i am pointing to this you will get to know it soon okay so let's say left is equal to error zero element right so at first left is equal to zero and the right is equal to the last i mean whatever the length of the array though that will be my right pointer at, at, at the very first right so length of the array minus one right so total length of the array is one two three four five six and uh, as the indexing is starting from zero that's why i have to give minus one right okay so at first my right pointer is here right will be here okay how at first i have to uh run a while loop while what while the left not equal to right or left uh, less than equal to right okay so what i will do until or unless left uh, less than equal to uh, right i will check if left not equal to right then perform this so i will append the right element at first and then i will append the left element just after the right okay so that the right element is the largest element and the left most element is the smallest element will be appended at the at the empty list okay so for that i have to initialize an empty list right so list let's say arranged list okay is equal to empty list okay so let me copy it arranged okay so i will append arrange dot append the rightmost element at the first so array uh rightmost means rigst sorry okay so this way i am appending the rightmost element that means the largest element because i have already sorted and the rightmost element is the largest element right and leftmost element is the smallest element so at first i am appending the rightmost that means the largest then i will do the same right like uh, appending the leftmost element so that the rightmost i mean the largest and the smallest in the next iteration the second uh second largest and then second smallest element will be appended at the arranged uh, array right okay now what i do 
I will say else what else that means when left will be equal to right then what should be uh, appended that is uh, from from I can print the left or the right because both are same right so I will append whichever okay I can print right or I can append right or I can append the left as well okay so now I have to write left plus is equal to 1 and right minus is equal to 1 because I have to go to the next element and I have to go to the previous element as well at the same time right so that's why I have to make my pointer to the next I mean I have to make my left pointer to the next element at the each iteration and I have to make my right pointer to the previous element at each iteration right so that's why I have to give right minus is equal to 1 and left plus is equal to 1 okay so I hope you understood whatever I have written as of now okay so at in the arranged uh, list I have appended all the arranged uh, element right so let me just return the arranged okay arranged list so this will return a list so I have already written actually the driver code so let me just call it okay So let me run it and see if this is giving right output or not. Show arrange array. Okay, so I have to change the name arrange. So I hope this will be fine. Okay, so 817253 as expected, right? And let's say, let me run it. Sorry, let me run it and see if this is giving right output or not. Okay, so just let me paste it. 82735 right as expected so i hope you understood the logic and syntaxes i used in python so if you didn't understand yet then let me know in the comment section or you can ask me in the telegram channel t.me slash ubikanna or in the instagram account instagram.com slash techno.uf or uh, if you want any other questions if you want any other company's content then let me know in the comment section i will try to upload that particular video okay so thank you for today's session